When we learned that Congo is known today as the most dangerous place in the world to be a woman because of the wholesale destruction of women and their bodies through rape, we knew it was a, a place that we had to get involved. Wamama Simameni means women stand up together. You empower women in one area and they are set off. It's like a launching pad for incredible initiative that these women have to deal with their own problems in the community. Many of the projects um, that we went to visit when we were in Congo really fortified our belief that the women in the Congo can pick up the pieces of their life and move forward learning new skills and finding a way to re-enter society. Another example of that hope is this group of women who decided that they wanted to improve the quality of their maternity care. They were willing to band together to develop a business, which is vegetable gardening, and with the money that they make from the selling of their vegetables, they're putting it into an insurance collective to pay for safer maternity care. <laughs> Benye walikuwa wanazalia kunyumba walikuwa wanakufa au watoto wanakufa lakini leo vifo vinapunguka. Sasa tukifanya umoja na tukiendelea ndani ya kikundi tunaweza fanya hata vitu vizuri zaidi ya hii kulima. Sababu hakuna kazi yenye baba anaweza fanya yenye mama wakiungana wawili ama watatu nao wanaishinda. Mwanamke iko mama ya wote walio hai. Na mwanamke njoo anapatia ka uhai kila mtu iwe president iwe guvernere iwe nani mwanamke ndio mwenye analeta kwake uhai mwanamke ni mama wa taifa mzima kisa hii kazi yangu ni kujitarisha ni angalia jinsi maisha yangu itaendelea mbele na kujua kutumika hii kazi ni saidia wengine katika kushona manguo unesaidia wengine sasa tunaweza ona mtoto mwakwite na mama wala baba unatafuta ikitepe na mshonea hinguo na mpatia unamwambia kwa na baada hii kwa jua una tena bazaari Congolese women are strong and resilient and by strong i mean they face unbelievable insecurity and brutality and atrocity daily but they build their communities and they come together in collectives they look for microfinance opportunities these women are motivated and ready and willing and able they can almost do it by themselves but what they need is a little boost and that's where we come into play if they wanted to buy their own parcel would it be this size goodness is contagious i believe that the more we are able to inspire and interact with others to do good that that good will reach others and continue to build and build and build she says that uh, there is much link i mean strong link between us mama in, in congo and mama from america and other countries because you have thought of us you have planned to come to see us you, you have a concern about us and we are doing something to help ourselves and if we can hold the hands in hand nothing will stand before us. We, we can do a lot we can achieve a lot hand in hand a lot all right good all right